friendly. But I don't feel like you should be friendly anyways. Because friendly hoes always end up at the bottom. What you mean by that? You're too nice. Y'all, I on. love Chris. We're gonna hop on your live. Let me hop on your live. I love Chris. Don't get me wrong. Too friendly. Do you hear me? Y'all, we be outside. <laughs> we can be outside at the club. Here come Chris. Hey, sis. Oh, you got social media. What's your social media? I can picture. I like. I know you. You're so crazy. Well, let me tell you something. I am such a people person, right? Like, I love getting to know people. I love going out and interacting with new faces and stuff Too like fucking that. Friendly. But that's how you look. I'm a very business minded person, right? That's fine, but so, I'm not gonna be taking pictures <coughs> with you on Snapchat trying to. Me. I love meeting new people, hearing people's stories, hearing people's perspectives. Why? That's how you grow. You can't grow hanging around the same people all the time. Mm -hmm. What if I don't bring nothing back to you? I don't trust people. It's not even about that. People try to get close to you to be weird. And they do, and you gotta filter them out. Nobody's to be trusted. You hear me? These hoes is not to be trusted. That's Chris' problem. You know what? I ain't even gonna get into all that. But that's Chris' problem. That's why about? Chris always in situations, I'm not gonna lie. Chris is, always has himself in certain situations with certain individuals because he's so... I love everybody. I'm, hold on. I'm not saying you're not supposed to love people, but it comes a point in time where you have to know where people stand in your life. Everybody doesn't deserve to be in your main circle. And you're not wrong about that. Your I business, your business oriented. That's fine, but everybody don't deserve to be in your crib. Everybody, everybody don't be in my crib. <clears throat> my crib, this crib. But you, but you have this thing with you if you if we out even if we out kicking it everybody don't deserve to be around your main friend group let's get into it yeah because y'all hoes don't like nobody no no y'all don't like nobody y'all hoes got to be like every time i try to invite new people around y'all be like y'all mm-mm <laughs> lisa said that's why I'm home, you hurt or hurt somebody <laughs> and she never that's why you know what i've taken i've taken a seat in the back well, I just stopped inviting new people around y'all until I, I fully know. Not he's trying to are. make it seem like it's his friend group, y'all. It's not Chris's friend no. group. No. Okay, let me let me explain what I mean by that though. It's not Chris's like, friend group. Y'all are. Don't get me wrong. I love my friends. My friends are dope as fuck. Like y'all are my family. Y'all not. I don't even claim y'all as friends. Y'all my family for real, for real. But when it comes down to new people. I already know y'all have such a distrust in new people, especially. Hold on, that's not true. Especially when I it gave all the hoes a chance. You did. You fair enough. You did give. I a get, chance. no seriously. I give everybody a chance. You mm -hmm. have one chance to prove me wrong because I'm already reading you. And that's the thing that I don't think people get about you is because like I know you be so calm, you be so cool, you be so much fun, and people be forgetting like especially new people they forget like no you're still under observation, I'm, you're still Please being you observed. So I think that like when it comes to you like yeah you be giving them chances but you be reading them at the same time and people not they used be to weird, be on the spectrum real. like that. So because females, I'm just gonna say females. Cause dudes too, they be having secret alternatives like automate. What? You're not wrong. What? Alternative motives. I get you. They do. Thank you for bringing that out. I got friend. you. I know what you were trying to say. <laughs> I got you. I got you. Thanks for bringing that out. But yes, because people always be on some sneaky. Cause why you want to be so close to me? You ain't wrong. I'm not gonna lie to y'all. Every time I post on Snap, right? I have a lot of Snapchat friends. Majority of them I probably don't even know, but I don't care because I am a businesswoman first. Mm -hmm. Mother first, businesswoman second. But why you hitting me up talking about you want to kick it with me and my friends? Because I want to be part of the Fab Four. What are you saying? That's not weird to you. Why you want to kick it with us? You ain't got no friends because that's a red flag. Hold on. Flag on a play. You is so crazy. Not just drawing out this hole. Why you ain't got your own friends to kick it with? That's so funny that you said that though. You ain't wrong. You is not wrong. What they say? And Paul said, um, they be low key jealous, hating, trying to um do your piece. Period. And just don't like you. That's true. And that's want to be around. You're not wrong. Lisa, did I hear one of a four and five, not six, but four, four, not five, but six, but. 
Okay. Literally, y'all. People just be weird. And hey, you're not wrong. Like, don't get me wrong. I watch people snaps all the time, and I be like, hey, they really turning up. I wish I could pop out, you know. Pop out with you, I be in the bed watching people whole live stories, Snapchats, whatever. But I never physically got in somebody inbox and said, I wanna, I wanna come out with y'all. Especially if you don't know me. Like, you've never seen me. We ain't never went to school together. We've never, nothing. You just know me from social media, but you wanna kick it. Correct me if I'm wrong, but that shit's a bit weird. But see, to me, I don't look at it as being Chris weird. Chris likes that shit, and that's why he gonna be a somebody trunk. 